Welcome everybody to the kitchen and the first thing my friend Lydia did to me when I came into the station she's like here you got to taste this uh, cheese spread because it is so good and I did and it just flooded memories yes. back to me of grandmas and great grandmothers why is that why is this, this so amazing? This is a pimento cheese spread which like your grandmother probably bought in like a little glass tub yes. at the store. Well she'd keep them too yeah. and use them as glasses. You'd use them as drinking glasses absolutely <laughs> the nostalgia um, but we are making real pimento cheese from scratch and then we're gonna take that and turn it into a grilled Perfect. cheese sandwich. What are we so, starting with here? We're starting with some sharp cheddar um, I like a really really creamy cheese so I've got some Cache Valley in here uh -huh. um, and my recipe says use two cups of sharp cheddar uh -huh. but when do we follow recipes here? Who? What recipes? Yeah right? exactly so I also <laughs> got some white cheddar and I also am putting in some pepper jack cheese in here. Oh yum a lot I of like flavors. A little, I like a little heat yeah. Yeah. But you can just stick to sharp cheddar if you want. Sure. I've got some pimentos that have been chopped and really do just, fine. Do you just buy those? In yeah, the you can, can just buy and... these in a can. Okay. Um, they come in about four ounce cans, and um, they ch come chopped pretty fine. Ooh, that smells really good. And they already. smell good. It they're smells like just like they're like sweet and yeah. a little hint of heat, but not too much. They okay. also are what add the color All right. to this. And then I have some cream cheese and also mayonnaise, a half cup of each. We're gonna pop that in there. We would take this also and fill it on celery sticks. Yes, absolutely. So You'd put it with celery another sticks. another use for it. We're going to do a little bit of paprika. You could do a little measure bit of cayenne like pepper. Do. Yep, no, nope. we're just going to measure with the heart. And uh, I've got some garlic powder in there as well. Now, the trick to this is you're actually going to blend it up okay. with a hand mixer. Oh, all right. Um, and that's what gives it the smooth and creamy texture okay. as well. And so I'm going to get this started. Do I need to stand back? And no, I'm a pro. I'm a pro. <laughs> I'm a pro. You're so, the one with the apron on, too. It's true. <laughs> So you can see how that starts to like blend up. I can see how that really up. creamy Exactly. Okay. That'll break the cheese we'll up. We'll keep working on this, guys. When we come back, we'll finish up these. I'm going to call them like old school delicious cream little cheesy grilled sandwiches, guys. All right. It's quite the title. Yeah. All right. Thank you. And these are the best grilled cheese sandwiches. Honestly, it reminds me, when she made these, I told you earlier, ah, oh, just remind me of grandma, just the aroma, the pimento cheese spread, little cups that she would buy, and yeah. oh, amazing. Tell me what kind of bread So, right now, I've on. got like a really good sourdough loaf mm -hmm. um, for this, and I'm putting some salted butter on it, which I think adds a little bit of flavor. Oh, yeah. So. I was at a, um, a breakfast this morning with my friends at the Port Council, Oh, yeah. One of the girls said, oh, we're really working on doing sourdough, her and her roommate. So, yeah. hey, this is a great recipe go. for you to do. Make up a loaf of sourdough and make this cheese. So I've got the pimento cheese spread on there. I've got butter on each side. Mm -hmm. And this is what it starts looking like. It just turns out like golden beautiful, brown. golden brown, nice and crispy. And then the inside oh, yeah. is just oh, like gooey, gooey melty, mm. delicious, really, really yummy. So um, pimento cheese sandwiches, by the way, are traditional. They, they serve them at the Masters, but it's like oh, the regular you know pimento that? cheese spread uh -huh. and then white, like white Wonder Bread. And that oh. is the Southern tradition. This one is just going to take it to a whole oh, new level. How fun. You know, growing up, I thought it was punishment. We never had Wonder Bread growing up because mom would make the most incredible homemade bread. Yeah. And now that I'm older, every time she'll come and visit her, I go up there, I'm like, Mom, do you have any of your homemade bread I can take back with me? Now it's like a treat to yes. have the homemade bread. Yes, it really <laughs> is. And so just go to a bakery, get the best loaf that you can. Great. Um, and this or will come out beautifully. Or make you're it. Or making it, yeah. Or make it. I want you all to head over to KUTV.com for the recipe or to my website, Cooking with Chef Brian. And Lydia, thank you for coming on and sh sharing with us your pimento cheese spread. Always Grilled delight. cheese sandwiches. Thank Always you, thank delight. you, Ron. Yeah, it looks awesome. Yeah. Thank you very much.